Here we go. So, who's going to be useful at the Circle of Magi? Well, me, obviously. Alistair will take yes. along. Come along. We'll take Leanna. I'm not going to take Morrigan again because, you know, we've been a wild merge and everything. So, Leanna probably, Indeed. Leanna probably a good idea. And um, do I really want to take... I'm curious to how Severan will work in um, in battle. Um, you know, in the actual game. Sort of a, a tanky kind of rogue, obviously, with his dual wielding. So I'm quite interested in, in, in his skill set and such. such. Bound is probably a um, good idea, though. But what I could do... I mean, I could leave Zevran with Morrigan. Because we don't, we don't really trust Zevran yet. I'm going to take him with me so that I know where he is. So I'm going to bring him along. Yes. And leave Bounder and uh, Morrigan at, at the camp. I think that's probably what I'm going to do. And we'll we'll give Zevran a, a run out and see uh, see how we do with this. Because, you know, Zevran and Bounder are both sort of melee types. So we'll, we'll just see how we get on. We might even get into a fight here. And I don't see why we should because this is home! Home would bound. Oh. Well, we get into a fight quicker than we might have expected. How did a child survive that? The crater is still smoking. It's a boy. Five fingers, five toes. That's all that matters to me. The Maker has answered our prayers. Let's go home, Marta and raise the tyke as our own. Superman? Metal ore from a meteor? <laughs> really? <laughs> really, 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 really. Really, really. Seriously. All right, well, now we get a chance to yes. look at him anyway. So let's uh, check out his equipment and such. He has no armor on. That could be an issue. I don't have any armor to give him. Well, no, not a shield. Splint mail, medium. Oh, he's wearing leather armor. A lot more fatigue in that. I think we'll... Um... Okay, so yeah, he's wearing armor leather. Hmm. Plus two dexterity. Let's see, so Crow Dagger, 15% 15 critical backstab damage, so he's a backstabber, that's cool, and a longsword. Uh, do we have any decent weapons? Another longsword, another dagger, a load of bows. And he's also, yeah, he's got a bow, okay. But yeah, we'll use him as a, um, a backstabber. Spells and talents. Let's have a look and see what he's like, shall we? So, massively high dexterity, decent strength, decent willpower. Uh, crap constitution, so don't get him hit. He's an assassin. Don't know what that does. Heroic accomplishments? Nothing. Although this is quite interesting. I've seen this before. Dragons killed? No, I killed none? Aw. Oh, I've killed a boss. It's probably the, 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 the ogre. Um. Hmm. World explored 19%, time played 20 hours. Okay. Um, 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 uh, what am I doing? Okay, yes, this. Okay, so you're an assassin, so... Tax, uh, mark target, deal additional damage. So you got mark of death there. Okay, what else have we got? Dirty fighting, below the belt, lethality. Well, that sounds good. Okay, nice. Uh, deadly strike. Normal damage, but gain a bonus to armor penetration. So that's that one. And that is passive. Nice. Blow the belt. Stealthy item use. Okay. High from view, although perspective enemies may not be fooled. All right. Uh, perspec per perceptive perspective enemies. Taking action beyond movement, including engaging in combat or using items, will still attract attention. Alright, so if you get him into a position where he can use that, sustain, sustained ability, then... Um, so why isn't... Okay, that's fine. Um, what else have we got? 
Dual weapon training. Dual weapon sweep flurry. Normal uh, damage flurry of three bros. Okay, that's sweet. So that's... Let's see. So dual weapon sweep. More damage than normal. Alright, so that's just a bigger hit. The sweep... Uh, sorry, the flurry is two, three hits. And the momentum is... Attacks, increasing attack speed. In, all right, so that that incre that cons in more hits, but more stamina usage. All right then, okay. Dirty fighting dual wield. Yeah, okay. All right, all right. I think I've. Uh, so this guy is pretty much um, an assassin. Yeah, he's a backstabber. Poison making, combat training. Hmm. Small bonus to attack. Warriors and rogues gain access to third tier weapon. Talents. Mages can take more damage from attack. Okay. Alright, so that's stealth, basically. Neat. Tell you, tell, tell you forward hole. Superman. Alright, and we're back here again. So. We return, finally. Um, so there's uh, Garol, but... Something's happening over here. Samuel the Berserker is there. Samuel. Shady Shug. Shady Shugs. Shady Shugs. A land a landmark boat. Oh well, I, I don't have bounder anymore. But um yeah, okay. Let's talk to you. The the deserter. The berserker. Deserter. Yes. Um Oh there we go, I'm here. Alright, so I'm here on behalf of the Blackstone regulars. Oh? What is this about? Well, he used all supplies from the guild. I worried this might happen. I hoped it wouldn't be you who came for me. I have no choice. Forgive me, Warden, but I cannot go back with you. Well, isn't that pleasant? Right, so you need to get around the back. You need to stand over here. You need to taunt. You also need to run away a little what bit. Now? I know, I know, I know. So, attack him, um, Liliana. Hang on a minute. Move freely. Thank you. Yeah, do that. Um. All right, attack him. Use that. Why have you gone over there, Zevran? Zevran, come back over here. Backstab him. Ooh, nice. Okay. Uh, right, mage. Par paralyze that dude. He's annoying. Good. And, yeah, peel. Takes a lot of hits, doesn't he? Repulsion. Warding. Yeah, no, that's all good. Let's get striking on you. I haven't checked out his uh, tactics yet, but I will. I will at some point. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Um, use that. And heal him again. Heal him. Thank you. Right, we should be okay now. Should be alright. Nice. Really injured? Okay, you're fine, man. You're fine. Shady, shady thug is dead. And then go and deal with him. This is not the time, Alistair. Okay. Alright, that was a uh, quest that we got. Done. Spirit Shard. Guild Supplies. Jolly good. Um, Landmark Boats. Hello. Well, look at this. I remember taking you across when you left with that fella Duncan. And now you're a Grey Warden. My pap used to tell me stories about them. Um, why are you manning the boat? Templars took the boat. Oh, uh, why would they take your boat? I don't got a clue. They wouldn't tell me. Gregor just came down and said, Don't you worry, Kester, we got it all under control, we do. Didn't say nothing else. And then he puts Carol in charge of my boat. Lissy, named for my grandmum she was. 
All right, I actually have notes on all these characters. Don't know if I know a Carol though. Nope, I don't know a Carol. But uh, yeah, Gregor, um, he was yeah the Knight Commander of the Chantry. Something wrong up there in the tower? I told you, they didn't tell me nothing. And if I know they're mages, I'm better off keeping out of their business. If I had to guess, I'd guess it had to do with magic. But the tower's always got something to do with magic. Yeah. Okay, then. Uh, I have to get in there. I'm on official business. Don't look at me. I told you, I'm not the ferryman no more. Oh. Gregor's told me to stay here till it blows over. But I'm telling you, some storms don't blow over easy. True enough. Um, I don't know why I'd be telling him that I convinced the Templars to let me in. But, um, I will. Maybe you could at that. I'm sure your mind's all afire now, eh? Do you know Gregor well? Oh, I can't say that. <laughs> I'm lucky he's good enough to give me the time of day. The first enchanter's all right. He's polite as can be, but he's always a little distant if you get my drift. But Gregor will stay to talk. I reckon he likes hearing from us common folk, you know? He's a man to be respected, that Gregor. Quite. Um, and your opinions on the circle? Why not? Well, I reckon it's good for them mages. Gather them all, learn them some proper magics. I know what they say about mages, but the Maker made them for a purpose. If you can't trust him, who can you trust? Indeed. Goodbye. All right. Keep safe, you hear? Oh. Interesting. All right, some yellow fruit. I'll just gather that. And a mage's collective liaison. All right. You're the Grey Warden, aren't you? Exactly who I was hoping to meet. Really? I represent a collective of mages interested in going about their lives without the constant scrutiny of the Chantry. Really? Hmm. Isn't that against the Chantry's laws? We harm no one, I assure you. And we enforce the Chantry's laws among ourselves. All we seek is a life outside of the Templar's shadow. Next to me, and in every major settlement, you will find an inconspicuous sack containing requests from mages all over the land who need the assistance of someone skillful and discreet. I see. So this is kind of like the Irregulars, but the mages sort of equivalent. Give me a reason not to turn you into the Templars? I don't know. I mean, it would make me a little bit of a... Um, it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. The word is gone. Make me a little bit of a when he says something and then does something else. Because, oh uh, God, that's really annoying when you can't think of a bloody word. But yeah. Um, oh, it was almost there. Oh, oh, sorry. Sorry. I'll try and move on. But yeah, with uh, with I mean, because I'll turn him in, but not Morrigan. So, I mean, when he was in the uh, circle, like, he would be very sort of devote to his studies and uh, sort of take everything as read. But since he's met Morrigan, he's, he knows there's sort of, like, more to life and to magic and to mages than what he's been told. So he's not going to turn this guy in. Uh, he's going to take a look at these requests. And I know I complained before about getting too many quests, but I shall take more of them because this seems innocent enough. And if I help fellow mages... I mean, it never really had that much of a love for the Chantry. So, mm, yeah, go on. Thank you, my friend. We have agents in every major settlement to reward you for work done on behalf of the Collective. Make us smile upon you. And now I know that there is a bag next to him. Although we'll do the Codex first. Despite the loyal t uh, loyalist grasp of the Mage's political community, many Libertarians and... Oh, there we go, we learned about this before. Aquitanarians have begun to see eye to eye with respect to the Chantry's role in the mage's daily life. A growing number of mages, particularly those uh, whose magic never s uh, strays from the Maker's mandate, feel that the Chantry's constant oversight is a burden upon their creativity and their very will, and one that hinders their ability to do their work. These mages, along with a number of hedge wizards who work their arts outside the Chantry's influence, have formed the Shadow Guild, a Shadow Guild of sorts, a Mages Collective, wherein members can submit requests and have them seen without judgment. This collective manages to work in relative secrecy, their members discreet and their clients anonymous. As of yet, this collective has seen no sanction from the Templars, yet, 
and has been uh, there has been no sign that its members are practicing magic which the maker would not approve still practicing of magic outside the influence of the chantry is a dream of some and is dangerous nation for others and many believe that this is only a matter of time before the veil of secrecy is lifted and Magus Collective is brought swift and brutal justice. Yeah, there is a risk with it. So far so good with it though, so... Oh, bloody hell. Okay then. Uh, hear me and obey. My power is waning. I, Blucher the Ephant, require um, a reconnection to the mystic places I've left behind. You, the bearer of this note, shall travel to these places and trace upon them my personal glyphs, claiming their Edith... Um, Edrith, Edrith's energies for my own. You will come upon sites of mystic power in ancient places of the world. Uh, the forest, the deep roads, the heart of Denerim, uh, near the base of the circle tower. I'm not sure about that one. Not sure about it. He seems a bit bossy. I don't, I don't like him. Not going to do that one. Careless acquisitions. Um, the activities of uh, the Mephicarium in my doorstep uh, did not go unnoticed, and now I am in danger of being brought before the Templars myself. A small band of drifters claim to have seen me practicing forbidden arts, and they have driven, uh, have left to deliver the testimony of my um, alleged deeds to the Chantry. I ask the mages collective to find and stop these false witnesses by any means necessary. No. There comes a time in each young mage's life where he must strike forth um, from beneath the shadow of his mentor. For my three young and unremarkable apprentices, it is t the time is now. He who accepts this calling takes it upon himself to deliver the documents of congratulations to my apprentices, who will no doubt be uninformed as to the contents of the missive. The apprentices' names are Starek, Alina, and uh, Sheth. I have um, cleverly sent them away from my abode so that they may receive this information in a public place, thus guaranteeing the safety of my willing courier. You will find them in Denerim, the other procuring a slightly rarer item from Oz uh, Ozmar. Um, I would not wish any harm upon that. They've got the feelings. Two, uh, two of them in Denerim. Alright, we'll do that one. We will accept that one. That's fine. Delivering notes. We can do that. My brother's killer. My worst fears have been realized. A band of devilish uh, Mephicarium are performing their profane rituals within close proximity to my own sanctum. This I cannot stand. I, uh, Jibasto, charge he who accepts this request to destroy the fiends before their evil beings uh, and want attention from either Templars or demons to my back door. Travel to uh, Brahilian Forest and slay these blasphemers. Uh, I reckon I'll do that. Herbal magic. Disaster! So consumed I have been in my personal products that I have uh, neglected to collect vital components of herbal remedy I use to sharpen my mind for thoughts um, of the other world. Without it, I am ruined! Ruined! I will humbly reward any who bring me ten bundles of deep mushrooms. Yeah, we'll do this. With this, I can continue my quest for enlightenment with a clear mind and fewer bouts of drowsiness and indigestion. Uh, may he accept this request be shadows in riches and love from the maker's heart for his noble and selfless act. This is literally my salvation. Doesn't say where he is, but I'll accept it. Okay. So I didn't do those two. They seemed a bit risky and possibly not what they seemed, but... The other ones, yes. Items received, quests updated. Here we go. Mages Collective. Okay, so just bring 10 bundles of deep mushrooms. I could do that possibly now if I had them. Brothers Killer, travel to the forest. Two of them in dinner and one of them in Osmogar. Um, have a look at the map and just see if anything's popped up anywhere. No. Hmm. Probably haven't found that forest then yet. But, yeah, it's cool. So uh, It's all good. It's all good. Alright, codex updated. No, oh, codex updated. My dear apprentice, I have sent this courier with a note to officially end your period of my apprenticeship. I have you no ill will, for despite your complete incompetence, you have failed um, to do a lasting harm to myself or my work. Sadly, I will not have a chance to witness your floundering attempts at improvements. When you return from your current errand, your apprenticeship will be over. Now hurry, I have a dire need of supplies I have sent you to procure. Okay, that seems fair enough. Alright, let's, uh, oh. Let's 
going here? I think this is a the Spoil Princess, I think it said. Should have taken a look at that. Spoil Princess. So is this an inn? Looks like it. Disgruntled patron, shady patron, and someone with a name. And an innkeeper. Someone with a name. Good day. Oh. Fine. Oh, what hello. Do you need? Uh, nothing. I thought you were someone else. Whoa. Steady on. Ha! <laughs> Water down ale. Damp beds. Rickety stools. Why do I even bother? So these are just travelers, aren't they? What are you looking at? Can a man drink in peace? Good day, and welcome to the Spoiled Princess. Is there something I can get for you? I thought I would have known why this thing was called the Spoiled Princess since I lived here. Or at least, you know, a couple hundred meters the other direction. But, um, why, why is it called the Spoiled Princess? It was my father's idea. He ran the inn before me and he named it for my sister. She was his little princess. Princess decided the country was too dull for her and moved to Denerim. More glamorous, she said. Well, she was found murdered, robbed of all the trinkets my father bought her with his hard-earned money. My father died of shock and heartbreak, mother stopped eating, and I got the struggling in. The name stuck. That's the story. <laughs> it doesn't really seem to... Yeah, it seems a little bit uh, resentful. I should get going. I'm not here of for a course. drink. If there's anything I can get you, just let me know. I'm not really here for a drink, am I? How many deep mushrooms do I have? Probably in, um, five. Hmm. That's okay. Well, this was interesting, but let's go. We have home to visit. And that is everything, right? Alright, let's let me handle this. You! You're not looking to get across to the tower, are you? Because I have strict orders not to let anyone pass. Um, exactly who are you? I am the person appointed to stop all unauthorized access to the Circle Tower. Meaning you, <laughs> because you're unauthorized. Okay, we'll be go. Bye. Um, I'm a Grey Warden. Uh... I mean, these guys, I don't know. Um, I need the first enchanter's help, basically. No, I have one job and one job only. And by the maker's shiny gold cutlery, I will do it. Um, you know he probably doesn't have cutlery, right? Oh, and he's told you that, has he? Well, you're still not getting into this tower. I have some documents that compel the circle to help me. This does reveal me as a Grey Warden, but I'm not going to get in otherwise, am I? So, documents. Yes. Oh, a Grey Warden seal. Aha. So you're claiming to be one of those. You know, I have some documents, too. They say I'm the Queen of Antiva. What do you think of that? Your Majesty. <laughs> um. Uh, I Queen's female. Don't question royalty. Anyway, it was nice chatting with you. Now, on your way, right now, go. Look, right, your superior won't like, um, won't like that you've gotten me in trouble. Persuading, here we go. Oh, really? You think Gregor would be upset with me for not letting you in? Wait, actually, he would. Good point. <laughs> um. Yeah, we should do our best to avoid that, shouldn't we? He's the big guy around here. I know. I bet he could deal with one Grey Warden. Alleged Grey Warden. Well, you want that I should take you there now? I do. Come along, I suppose. So there it is. Haven't seen that since the start of the game. Here we go, talking about the bloody fade again. Been there twice already. Old news. And I want two men stationed within sight of the doors at all times. Do not open the doors without my express consent. Is that clear? Yes, sir. The doors are barred. Are they keeping people out or in? Now we wait and pray. Ah! It's good to see you again. Yeah. No, uh, if 
Go on, what's going on here? I don't have time to entertain visitors. Well, look who's back. A proper Grey Warden now, are we? Glad you're not dead. Is that a question? Um, truly glad I'm not dead. What's happening? Why are the great doors barred? You're looking well yourself. A bit harried. Perhaps. Now we're dealing with a situation that doesn't involve you, Grey Warden. See, I've, I've lived here all my life. As soon as I leave, things just go like this, don't they? Things happen. Yeah, this tower was my home. I don't know what happened. More serious sort of uh, turn, but yeah, that works. I shall speak plainly. The tower is no longer under our control. Abominations and demons stalk the tower's halls. We were too complacent. First Jowan, now this. Don't think I've forgotten your role in Jowan's escape. I didn't do anything. Actually, I have news of Jowan. Yeah, well, yeah. I have news of Jowan, yeah. Do you? That's surprising. Yes, um... I won't tell you where he is. <laughs> I know a secret, but I'm not telling you. <clears throat> um... He was hired secretly to a, to a child in magic, and that went so well, didn't it? <sighs> Turn Logan I had him to kill, to, ki to poison Al Airman. Yeah. And now? I won't tell you where he is. And I can no longer compel your cooperation. I can only hope that someday Jowan gets what he deserves. But right now I have other pressing concerns. So what's become of the first enchanter? We don't know. We saw only demons, hunting Templars and mages alike. I realized we could not defeat them and told my men to flee. You should have fought them. For your bluster, your Templars are just cowards. I would have done the same. <sighs> what could I... Well, you should have fought them, because that's kind of your job. They took us by surprise. We were prepared for one or two abominations. Not the horde that fell upon us. And you're still waiting here, isn't that dangerous? It is our duty as Templars to watch the Circle Tower. We will stand guard to make sure nothing leaves. Nothing. I will destroy the tower, raise it to the ground. But I cannot risk more of my men. The doors remain shut, and they will protect us for now. The way is shut. You shut everyone in there, including innocent mages? Not just mages, but my Templars also. I had no choice. The abominations must be contained at all costs. Heavy stuff. We do not mean for the doors to stay closed forever. Everything in the tower must be eliminated. I have sent word to Denerim, calling for reinforcements and the right of annulment. Oh boy. Um, I know what that is. I know what that is. How can you think of annulling the entire circle? Well, I, we know what good it can do. I, 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 so this is the only one that actually um, fits. The right of annulment basically means just wiping everything out. Everything. Which is what seems to have happened anyway. But, um, how can you think of annulling these? Obviously, because of what's happened, but I'll ask it anyway. The mages are probably already dead. Any abominations remaining in there must be dealt with, no matter what. This situation is dire. There is no alternative. Everything in the tower must be destroyed so it can be made safe again. You're right. <laughs> Uh, there must be another way. If there was, do you not think I would have chosen it? There are only abominations left in this tower. No one could have survived those monstrous creatures. It is too painful to hope for survivors and find... nothing. Very well. I will go. If you're so sure, then why wait? Yeah, let's go with that one. Only the Grand Cleric in Denerim can authorize the annulment of the Circle. And we must wait for reinforcements. If we enter the tower now, we will be massacred. I cannot order my men to their deaths. While the door holds, we wait. Right. Inram must have received our message. It cannot be much longer. Hmm. It's too much. 
Obviously I'm going to help, but uh, there must be something I can do. Is there not still so much going on that's unexplained? I too would like to know how this started. Hmm. Well, I will help you if you wish, you know. Will you join my army? <laughs> It's not much of an army, dude. I gotta say, you know, it's like four people and a dog, uh, and he's like dedicated and everything. So no, I, I will investigate. I'm not even going to ask him for help. I'm going to tell him I'm going to investigate the tower and see what can be done. You must face and slaughter the abominations to get to the bottom of this. Are you sure you can handle them? Not really. The first abomination. Have I? I have. I'm confident in my abilities. I've faced abominations before. That is a surprise. Did you manage to put it down? Yes, it was the child that Jowan had been teaching magic. It was a demon that possessed a child, that was the one. If you have fought an abomination, then you understand their evil. I do. You know what they are. Madness and cruelty made flesh. You think you can deal with them when even Templars are loath to enter the tower? I must try, it's the right thing to do, and I really have to. So, yeah, I mean, he's totally going to do it. There might be people alive in there who he's grown up with. We need to do this for the main quest, and it's his home. Um, yeah, totally. I see no reason why he wouldn't be doing this. A word of caution. Once you cross that threshold, there is no turning back. The great doors must remain barred. I will open them for no one until I have proof that it is safe. I will only believe it is over if the first enchanter stands before me and tells me it is so. If Irving has fallen, then the circle is lost and must be destroyed. May Andraste lend you her courage, whatever you decide. Wow. Well then. Oh yeah, so I've got the one. I've got him. Okay. Um. Where the bloody hell is the one that I was just... Sorry. Um. Yes, the Circle Tower has been overrun by abominations and demons, and it's no shape uh, to help the Grey Wardens battle the Blight. Knight Commander Gregor intends to use the Knight of Annulment in the Circle um, to lock the Great Doors and Tower until reinforcements arrive. However, he has promised that, um, the aid of the Templars if you can deal with the Circle. Destroy all hostile, dangerous uh, creatures in the Tower so that Templars are free to join in your army. Yeah, it's not much of an army so far. Alright. Well, we're gonna loot this. I don't want to die. Nobody wants to die. Oh, did I close that? that silly thing to say. I don't want to die. Hmm, he's still pretty tough. Not that I would think about fighting him, but Ah. Well then. As I recall, shutting the door and throwing away the key was definitely the Templar plan B. <laughs> I wish this were over. We're running low on supplies, and I don't know how much longer we'll last. Well, let me just buy everything. Uh, do you have supplies for sale? Yes. Would you like to trade? Yes. I love that. Do you have supplies? Yes. Do you want to trade? No. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll, we'll buy all them. Um, I thought they would have more uh, Lyrian portions than that, honestly. Deep mushrooms? Just curious if you have any... You don't have any deep mushrooms, do you? No deep mushrooms for you. Rackable malachite. Nope. Because that would have been handy. Alright then. Fine. Um, do I have anything to sell you? You know, stuff like uh, other. Wine, for example. Ale. Lamb. Oh, that's a gift. Alright then. Yeah, these are gifts... Hmm. Quartz, we'll get rid of them. Private documents. I'm going to sell them. I've had them forever. The blank paper. Sell them. Of course, Lambone, yeah, that's for, for, for Bounder. So that's fine. Undressed is Grace. Lightning Rune. I might sell them. Hmm. Okay, we'll keep them for now. I keep saying that. I'm never going to use any of them. Alright, that's good. I'm fine. Um, do you have a backpack? I can't afford it. Right, we have to try and find that backpack. I'm going to sell these. 
still can't afford it. Need. Need. Wait a minute. I have loads of, like, this kind of stuff. Heavy maul. Nobody uses that. Uh, we'll sell the daggers. I want the backpack. A small flawed fire crystal. That's probably very nice. Okay. Well, we've got some armor. Yeah, I got all this kind of stuff. I am just selling them all, yes. It's probably not the best idea because... Okay, I can afford uh, the backpack now. Just realized that uh, I could maybe have given some of that to you. <sighs> well, possibly not. Well, not anymore. Oh yeah, sell those, sell those shields. Sell the shields. Come here. Not that you're going anywhere. Look, stop wandering around. Oi! I wish this were over. We're running Silence. low on supplies and I don't know how much... Yes! Do you have supplies? You yes? Do you want to trade? No. <laughs> I don't think this electrical damage... Electrical damage. Oh no, wait, that's the... Uh... Okay, we'll keep that one. Alright then, so, saving the game. Going into the tower. Hi. They'll rip you apart and eat you from the inside out. That's nice. Here we go. Let's have Alistair go first. Yes. No, I'm scared. Okay. Challenge accepted. I <laughs> how he shook his head. He was like, oh, they're not coming back. Trapping you in the tower. Yeah. Right then. Alistair. I am going to loot from here. Because obviously they don't need stuff anymore and we could use all the stuff that we get. Oh, good. New quest. Uh, the Curse of Tower has allowed an apprentice to stumble across something ancient and hidden. Find all of his notes to reveal a possible secret in the tower. Oh, boy. No, 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 and stop asking. I'm not getting in trouble because of you again. I don't care what's in the basement, and neither do uh, the senior magi. Everything um, is about Uldred and the upper floors. I don't know what you're digging up, but those tomes um, are way older than our lesson texts. An apprentice should n shouldn't touch them. Threads burned before giants be erased. It stands alone and whispers unknown faint. Hmm. Oh. Allow me. I could do that for you. I hope so. Thank you. Need those. Pile of filth. Ah, memories. Very well. What's in this pile of filth? A deep mushroom. Superb, that's six of them. Get that quest done before we know it. Hmm. Dead mages, dead mages, dead templars, dead mages. Okay. Now I, I do realize that there's Um, Alright, I'm telling you guys, it's like, um, it's a test like the summoning. Why else would su would lessons be cancelled? And that outburst in the library with Uldred, uh, an older tome fell to a page on the reaching. I copied, uh, the reaching, I copied uh, what I could before they pushed us out. Sword lowered, strike through the ground. You can't tell me I wasn't supposed to see that. It's too convenient. I'm looking for more, and you'll be smart to help. Right, say no. Hmm. As you wish. Allow me. I could do that for you. Go ahead. Apprentice Cowl. Go on then. Go on then. No. You. Hold position, please. Apprentice Footlocker. More pages? Mm-hmm. Oh, 
the spot. Makers win, uh, Darai said I'd wait. But it's not just a disagreement. Uldred sent abominations loose. One was in my mentor's robe. Um, if you make it here, something in the spot may help you out. No point in hiding it from the senior mages now. I don't worry about uh, Denry's usual fee for moving his bed. He's dead. <laughs> and a pile of filth. Acolyte staff. Hmm. I'm not keen on these piles of... Alright, everyone gather together. <laughs> okay. Need to toggle that on when I have... Um, demons to deal with. Like now!